On the 4th of July this year, I'll be thinking about my friends, my family, and the beautiful country I've come from. On July 4th this year, I will be thinking about my California family and friends throughout the U.S. Also, please remember to listen to health official advice and stay safe. In this election year, I would like to remind us all, to quote from Talkville, that America is great because she is good. If America ever ceases to be good, she will cease to be great. Happy 4th. On July 4th this year, I'll be thinking about all my family and friends back in the United States and how different it will be celebrating this year from in the past. When I was growing up in California, my friends and I would always decorate our cars with red, white, and blue ribbons and balloons, and then drive around the city visiting all the various fireworks stands to purchase a few dollars worth of fireworks from each one. Later in the afternoon, we'd have a huge big block party with all of our neighbors and have a barbecue and homemade ice cream. And then in the evening when it got dark enough, we would have a big fireworks display with all the fireworks we bought throughout the day. On July 4th this year, I'm thinking about how wonderful it is to live in a country that truly embraces multiculturalism. Here in Brisbane, the local council and other businesses are lighting up iconic structures in red, white, and blue to help us celebrate our national day. Now that's what I call mateship. Cheers, Australia. Hello from Brisbane. Uh, this is 4th of July. We're thinking of friends and family back home, hoping everyone's safe. And we're looking forward to having some friends over here for an American themed barbecue. And celebrating this one's first 4th of July. Hi, I'm Megan Fitzgerald. This July 4th, I'll be thinking about all of the current, former, and future American and Australian Fulbright scholars. Senator J. William Fulbright characterized the Fulbright program as an avenue of hope. This exchange of ideas between countries is vitally important, now more so than ever. The Fulbright program has endured for over 70 years and continues to do so. On July 4th this year, I'll be thinking about the last time I went to the United States and how my family came out to California to meet us in Monterey and the great time we had. And how the next time I can go to the States, if and when, my mom, who has dementia, might not even recognize my face or have the chance to meet my daughter. This 4th of July, I hope that family and friends back home stay safe and the things that are happening in the U.S. result in positive change on the other side. On the 4th of July this year, I will be thinking about my family and friends back home in the States, um, as well as how we as Americans can make our country um, through the election and so forth, one that is truly um, holding liberty and justice for all. On 4th of July this year, I'm thinking about the meaning of this date in American history and if it was ever meant for people that look like me. But I know God is in control of even times like these, so I can hope in a future when we celebrate the date we have finally weaved equal value in all human life through the fabric of our nation. On July 4th this year, I'll be thinking about my family and friends and how I grew up celebrating Independence Day each year in my small hometown. With barbecue, music, games, laughter, fireworks and sparklers. And I'll also be thinking about my belief and hope that Americans from various viewpoints and diverse backgrounds will come together in small towns and big cities alike and continue to celebrate our great country that is America.